All right, I want to try something a little different, maybe something new. As you can see, I have Digimon World 2 up on the screen right now. If this goes according to plan, I'll be able to have something go alongside the um, Pokemon Super Eevee Edition, and I can uh, <laughs> put off the whole heart gold thing I was planning on doing for a while because I can't seem to find an emulator that wants to work for me. It just wants to crash and freeze and give me a whole bunch of other problems and it wants to be difficult. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Speaking of which, I gotta remember the buttons on here as well. So, I, I, I just realized that's a thing too. But uh, whatever, let's try and get into it and see what we can come up to. I gotta say though, I really love this game. Like, growing up a long time ago, I, I've honestly never beat it. I came really close. I have the disc version on my... For, for the PlayStation, I came really close to beating it, but for whatever reason, I just I just couldn't do it. I don't I don't know what happened. Hey guy, let me through. I got to see the leader. Hello, Mr. Zudicorn. It's nice to be see you. And let me see. You're a cadet tamer. Your name is I should really name you John Cena. Um what's the back button? Oh, it won't even fit if I did want to go that keep the meme alive. Um you can Oh, it doesn't fit. How dare you? Um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Give me that P. Um, I'm, I'm just trip. I'm, I'm, ju I'm just trip to you. Wait, can I fit it? Um, I should be able to fit it. I mean, come on. No. Nope. Redo. Damn it, we're already to a bad start. I spelled my name wrong. I is this an omen or something? Yes, you're a trip, aren't you? Please go right ahead. The Blue Falcon leader is waiting for you. Little side note, I don't care for any of the other factions that you'll see in this game besides besides the one you're gonna see me pick. Uh, I'm gonna let that be a surprise. For the moment. Trip, your training is almost over. You'll be a real tamer when you finish your last training mission. Then you can join the guard team. Okay, Mr. Zucorn, I'll do my best. Do do. Gotta say, music goes hard, but I remember I would, whenever I would try to get my Digimon stronger and grind them, I would always fall asleep in the dungeon. And I'd wake up and I'm just like, do I feel like doing this? I just tell myself. I, I don't know if I can do this. I, I can't. And I think that's the main reason why I didn't beat the game because you have to um, do a lot of different things to be able to get through a certain dungeon because they have these traps. And sometimes these traps will block your way. And the bugs. Oh my god, the bugs are the biggest pain ever. And I never really carry bug zappers or whatnot. I just rely on my defenses. Blue Falcon Leader, here's Trip. Zutacorn, I've been waiting for you and Cadet Trip. This is your last training mission, Trip. I'm glad that you made it this far. When are you done with this training mission? You can join a guard team as a tamer. Then you can work as a defender of Digital City, just as you've always dreamed. Yes, Blue Falcon Leader, I'll do my best. I will defend Digital City with my fellow Digimon. I have to say, this game right here... This game right here is the main reason why I love Digimon over Pokemon growing up. And if they continued the whole, like, dungeon crawler fashion, well, more so the RPG elements like this one had, I, I probably would still love Digimon to this day. I mean, like, the newer ones, like, I don't know, the last one I played, it carried that dungeon crawler element, but it was more of a a live action thing where your Digimon would have guns. I think it was like World 3 for the PlayStation 2, I'm not sure, or 4 or something for PlayStation 2, I don't remember. But it was, it was fun to play, but it felt harder for whatever reason. I guess because I didn't know how to like really train and level up and whatever, what I was supposed to do. Because I'd be like, hey, we want you to go here and fight this boss. And then you'd be like, wait, how am I supposed to get there? These keys, or just whatever. And when you die, you lose like all of your money, I, I believe. I know you lose a lot of stuff. It's like a Dark Souls type of thing before Dark Souls is a thing. Hey Trip, don't get too worked up. Zudicorn and Trip, this is your mission. Go to Boot Domain and destroy Leomon hiding there. Zudicorn, as this is a training mission, don't help Trip too much. Roger, Blue Falcon Leader. 
we will go to boot domain and destroy wild Digimon. <laughs> yeah, that that's real training right there. Hunting, hunting the wild. That, that's what we want to teach our kids. That's what we want to teach our kids, right? <laughs> Hi, Carol. How's it going? Is my Digi Beetle ready to go? I want to take it for a spin. I actually really love the Digi Beetle. I don't know why. I just thought it was the coolest thing as a kid. It was just one of those things. I was just like, it's amazing. Of course, your Digi Beetle is standing by. Hey, Trip, aren't you finished with your Tamer training yet? Not yet, Chief. This is my last training mission. After this mission, I'll get my own Digi Beetle, so I'm gonna do my best. Hey, don't push my Digi Beetle too hard and break it, okay? But don't worry, running over a land main, land mine or two won't do much damage to my Digi Beetle. I'm on an emulator, but I'm wondering, was the um the random capitalizations and whatnot, random letters being all jumbled up, was that like that before in the original? Because if you look at mine, it's capitalized. But then again, maybe it's calling a landmine like, hey, that's a proper landmine, I don't know. But the G looks weird in damage. Anyway, a Digi Beetle is not like an ordinary car, it's more like a tank. It's a multi-use tank with all the items and equipment that Tamer needs. Trip, good luck. Trip, let's get on the elevator lift. Never in my life have you ever, and I mean ever, ever, use the one on the right. Are you guys ready? The elevator is going to move. Be careful. The world is full of dangers and wild Digimon outside the city. I'm probably. No, good thing. Good thing no one watches these, are they? <laughs> they probably would be, hey. Well, what's with that ever, huh? What, what, what are you doing there? Are you, are you trying to steal? EP! We have arrived. This is the boot domain. Stay alert. Yes, I will. I've been training hard for this day. I'm ready. The bane of my existence is EP! Oh, that brings back so many nights of frustration and anger. Cause you only get so many damn steps. Um, okay, that does that. What am I doing? It doesn't even matter that I bring that. When I really think about it. Um. Okay, so that goes to the menu. I'm I'm trying to get a better feel of the controls. Let's check out our Digimon. Does he have any in the server? Nope. What well, we got in Digi Beetle? We got Agagi. The Mega Seedramon. Whew. He's an ultimate, data, and water. Oh, this thing does have the, um... It has a typing type setup, I guess you can say. Like, data Digimon are super effective against the vaccines. But they're... But they're weak against viruses. Um, vaccine beats virus. Yeah, that's how it is. Vaccine beats virus, but virus beats data. Data beats vaccine. There we go, yeah. But, I believe vaccine... Yeah, I already, yeah, I already said all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was confusing myself with the little triangle thing. It's just a, a one-way point of who does what. Because vaccine and... Um, wait, who's neutral to each other? I don't know. Actually, no one's neutral to no one. Um, yeah, we're gonna just go for a lightning spear. We're, we're, we're gonna kill these things with all of our power. Oh yeah, man. Curing. Curing is, is, is the ultimate thing in this game. It's so overpowered. If you have at least one Digimon with an HP cure, or whatever, even if it's a small one, you're, you're, you're overpowered. Especially if you're guarding, taking it. it it's it's the coolest thing ever. And the biggest thing I wonder about this game now since I'm really paying attention to it more is is this voice acting or is it just like random sounds because it really sounds like they're saying words because some of them will, will actually say stuff like this guy well it didn't sound like a word but it, it's just curious you know guard and you you finish him off hit him with a volcano strike By the way, guarding restores your um, MP points in this game. Die! Do 
39. That was nothing. That was chicken feet is what it was. Remember I tried coming here like right after finishing this little tutorial mission. I got my ass kicked <laughs> by those two. Look Trip, that's a floor portal. You can jump to another floor when you step into it, but you cannot get back to the floor where you came from. This time, we won't have to come back to this floor, but normally, you must be careful. Roger, Mr. Pseudocorn. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of stuff I gotta try and remember now when it comes to this. A lot of stuff. Mr. Pseudocorn, the floor here is different. Yes, very observant of you, Trouble. That's a specialty floor. It's blue because that floor is of a water specialty. When you battle on the water specialty floor, damage from water techniques increases. Also, the defensive ability of Digimon with the water specialty increases. Are there floors with other specialties? Yes, fire specialty is red, nature specialty is green, machine specialty is gold, darkness specialty is black. There are five specialties in all. If you know the specialties of Digimon and their techniques, you can take advantage of them. I see, I can make my Digimon stronger this way. But if I fight them on the floor with the same specialty as the enemy, they become stronger. That's right, that's why you must learn from the, those Digimon. Learn about the different specialties and techniques of the various Digimon. Be careful not to battle on the floor with their same specialty. Roger, I'll pay attention to the floor colors. Oh yeah, I forgot, I forgot about that. There are, like, elements per se, but I don't think the elements make a difference on, you know, the Digimon. Like, if you have your Wather Digimon using Wather attacks on a Fire Digimon, I don't think it's gonna really give you more damage. I think it's only the floors. Yes. We're about to beat the boss Digimon. What? How do you know that? Call the Tamer's Hunch. Yeah, whenever you're in a long quarter like this, it means you're about to... Well, no, we don't run from battle. It means you're about to fight a Digimon. Especially when you have the green walls around you. Who are you, a weakling guard tamer? Do you think you can defeat the boss of this boot domain, the great Leomon? Trip, that's the Leomon we've been looking for. When you defeat this wild Digimon, your training mission will be complete. Good luck. Yes, sir, Leomon, here I come. I think this is the best, um, well, honestly, I think it's just the best song in the entire game, really. When it really comes down to it. Alright. Let's see, what do you have? Flower Cannon? Okay, we'll get rid of the Toy Ogumon. And I'll explain more as the, um, battle goes on. Volcanic. Oh, let's just go for a Trihorn attack. We'll get rid of the, um, Vidramon. All right, let's see. We'll, we'll talk about that when it comes to his turn. All right, as you can see, Sagermon using that Ice Blast, there's a certain attacks that hit all Digimon. These can actually come in handy and be quite powerful. As you can see, you can save MP because I just took out Toy Agumon with two turns. Oh, and there's also counterattacks. Some counterattacks get a special bonus when you get hit. Some of them means more power, and others mean um, like some type of status helmet that's a guaranteed guaranteed status helmet if it's a counterattack. It could be a pain in the ass, really. Especially if you get hit with confusion. Confusion is the worst in this game. I I, I can tell you that much right now. Like as you can see, we have a counterattack of our own. We're gonna try and use it on the Vigermon. We're gonna just go crazy on the Leomon. Oh, the other thing is, depending on the counter attack, you're gonna target that very same Digimon that attacked you. A big question I wonder is what happens if you run out of EP in this first dungeon? Like, I've never cared to even try anything. Okay, uh, that sucked. And most of the time, with a counter attack, you either have attack missed, or um, you you'd normally do the attack, but without the special effect. I I, for, I forget, but sometimes I think you'll get an attack miss because you have to get you have to get hit. And with that, we won our we, we 
we won the battle. But that was too easy. We we need our own Digimon. We 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 need to get stronger on our own. Look over there. It's the exit portal. Your mission is complete when we get out of this domain by entering that portal. Phew. I just have a little more to go. Let's go. I've actually came close to the exit portal and ran out of EP right on top of it. Yeah, if you have one EP before and you hit zero on top of an exit portal, you don't leave! And you have to start all over going through the dungeon. Luckily, you won't have to fight a boss again, but you have to go through the stupid dungeon again. It's dumb. Like, there, there's certain quirks with this game that I hate, and that's one of them. I hate EP. Why do I need... Why does my tank need gasoline, pretty much? <laughs> like, damn it, you're battery powered. No, 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 you're, uh... Shit. No, okay, I, 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 I'll let that slide, maybe. Well done, Trip. You passed the last training mission. Now all you need to do is to join a guard team and become a real tamer. You did very well. Thank you, Mr. Zootocorn. Trip, you're really good. But in order to defeat the wild Digimon, you must train much harder. Okay, I will. Next, you have to choose a guard team you like. By law, a tamer must belong to one of three guard teams to be an active tamer. Oh yeah, I have to get you a Digibeetle. Then, I'll give you a tamer license to prove that you have become a real tamer. I do like the Chief's music. I used to find myself just bobbing my head with it, you know, having a good old time. Hey, Carol, can you get a Digibeetle for Trip? Trip has finally completed, completed training and will become a real tamer now. That's great, Trip. Congratulations. Thank you, Chief Curl. Now, let me get you your own Digibeetle. First, let me check your tamer license number. Then, I'll prepare your Digibeetle. Okay, your Digibeetle comes with a steel body. It's designed for beginners. Now, join a guard team and get a Digibeetle browser. Then, you can go on on a mission. Thank you very much, Chief Carol. Mr. Zulicorn, I can finally be a real tamer. Thank you! Hey, we got a tamer license and a digibeetle. Finally, you could you got your own digibeetle. Give it a name. Okay. Um, what should I name this digibeetle? I don't even know. Did I know that? We'll give it no name. Hold up. Let me think. I'll be back. All right. I asked a friend of mine. He was like, "Hey, um." I'm sure I would like to be named after something, so I'm gonna name this Digibeetle Fear because that's the that's the nickname he likes using. So Fear the Digibeetle, we gotta sound intimidating. That's a nice name. Don't you make fun of it? It's intimidating, Zootocorn. What type of name is Zootocorn? Zootocorn, Pseudocorn. You're not even real corn. You're knockoff corn. You 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 make people. Yeah, dick. You're on your own now. Make sure you join a guard team that suits you. Good luck. I kind of just want to hit the um John Cena thing when they salute like that. Just do 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 do. Can I? I, I doubt I could even save if I wanted to. But we're gonna try and save on here. It's gonna say there's no memory card inserted. Yeah, I thought so. So I have to find out how to save. But I'm gonna wrap things up here. I hope that you all are happy to be able to join me on this adventure. I think this is gonna go alongside the um, Super Eevee edition. I figured, eh, might maybe throw some nails on here and I wanted to have another RPG on here and this is the only thing I can think of Ugh. at least for the moment that'd be easy to work with you know without giving me t hopefully too many headaches so all right well enough of me rambling hope you all have an amazing day thank you for tuning in and as always thank you come again